This is my drum corner. I love her. She um, is an Ashford drum corner. And uh, I guess the, the, op the thing about the drum corner, the Ashford, is that it has this, this brush that beats down. Otherwise, I've used other drum corners and actually literally use a brush to beat down. Sometimes I use this um, when I'm adding things and I will most likely be doing that when I'm making this bat for the coat. But the reason I'm here is because I have this and it is, I didn't clean my drum corner after the last time I used it. I don't know about you guys, but that is so disappointing when you're going to use a tool. Yep, and you gotta clean it first. So here I am cleaning my drum corner. This, this brush um, is awesome. I use this brush to clean my, my hair brushes, but I also use it to clean my iRobot brush. If you guys have, we call ours Rosie, but if you have a um, iRobot vacuum and it gets filled with dog hair, yep, this is amazing. So you're not gonna wanna watch me clean this off and it was my own laziness that I'm at this point when I'm super duper excited about moving forward with making the first bat towards, well, potentially being part of that, that coat, the uh, denim coat, and I have to sit here and clean. So it also comes with this tool that I keep under here, um, and I don't know whether you see this, but I keep my drum quarter on this Ikea table that comes with wheels, and it is awesome because I can wheel it anywhere in the house when I feel like working on it, and I can wheel it back into its little spot when I'm done. Other people actually have to like take it out of their spot and clamp it down to use it. And I just, I'm very happy with using my Ikea table. All right, look how pretty we're looking. It's nice and clean. Oh, let's get rid of all this white. You know, I do use this brush a lot. Um, I get a lot of small fibers around the edges. And another cool thing about this drum corner is that I Frank cut a piece of cardboard for me. And check that out. It catches all the debris that falls from the fiber when you are, especially when you have raw fleece, right? And you're prepping it. So... This catches it and I can slide it out and it doesn't make a mess under there, which means I would have to unclamp it. So, in the garbage, there we go, put it back. And, all right, we are clean and ready to start drum carding the next project.